These are the two most popular chairs on the market, the Helinox and your Flexlite Air. Which one's better? We're gonna take a look at that right now. All right, let's put these together. You have to excuse my microphone. This I'm old school. I got a cord going straight to my microphone. And that's how I roll. Um, so as you can see, the Flex Light has this rotating nightmarish setup. Can't stand it. Um, and then the Helinox has this very nice stable platform to work on that does not rotate. You get enough flex in the material. You don't need this to be rotating on you for sure. Uh, so we'll put together the Helinox here. It has a marking that says this end up. Very nice, supportive. Put one up there, put one up here. And since it doesn't rotate on you, you can just pick this up very conveniently and stick it on in there. Just like that. Voila. Very easy to set up. And then we will do the flex light from REI. The tag is up. That's one. Very unstable. It's it's you have to be very very careful. Ginger. You pick this up, it's it's not really gonna cooperate on you unless you kind of lever this because it wants to rotate on you. So more it just this is more difficult to put together. It doesn't want to cooperate as much. There we go. All right, so here's your two separate seats. Um, and yeah, this kind of looks unfinished. This is how it looks. It kind of looks, because it doesn't have these nice cutouts like the Helinox. All right, guys, welcome to Doggo Running's uh, chair lab. So here's the Helinox. This is a 10 degree departure, which uh, most of your office chairs are 10 degrees. Most of your chairs are 10 degrees. Ooh, very nice. Feels very chair-like. Nice support. Ooh, that feels good. Um, I can stretch out. It doesn't, it's not pinching here. It's not pinching up here. I am 5'11", uh, just under 200 pounds. It's not pinching. Feels good, uh, feels stable. Uh, you have movement, but you have a lot of flex here. It feels great, it feels good. Can I work on maybe my stove? Um, working in between your legs, maybe a little bit of a stretch. Uh, working maybe on a camp stove, this level, not a problem. Or up here, like that. Okay, let's try the REI, Flex Light. Definitely feels smaller. I feel like I'm too big for the seat right off the bat. I feel just too big for it. This is a 20 degree departure, not a 10. Um, sitting up, better. Um, if I was cooking or doing something, this would be very convenient. Sitting up feels nicer than the Helinox. No support on the back. I feel like I'm just gonna go. And this is uncomfortable, this is pinching. This is, you'd have to, you'd need like a foot rest or something. Um, yeah, this is for a smaller person. I'd say someone that's maybe 150 pounds, maybe a child, and very unstable feeling. I don't know if the movement's coming from where, but it just feels like it's just very unstable. The Helinox, one pound, one pound, two ounces, and three grams. All right, we got the Flexlight Air, and that's gonna come to one pound and nine grams. Woo, that is nothing. Basically one pound. All right, so in summary, I'll let you guys make your own choice. You can see the comfort difference and the price difference was $30. And that Helinox right there is $30 more and uh, weighs just a little bit more. That little pocket knife kind of tells you how much it weighs extra. So it's just a little bit extra weight for just a far superior chair um, and $30 extra. So that's something to look at. So hit that like button, subscribe and support. Thanks.